Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. We'll continue, continue doing 8.2. Let me see this problem, integral, square root of x, linear square root of x. Um, very clear, I will take let equal u equals square root of x, see what will happen. I have du 1 over 2 square root of x. Mm. So it means I will rewrite this square root of x, square root of x over 2 square root of x or 2 square root of x, then square root of x dx. So that will be my du. And don't forget to have dx. That will be my du. Then I return now everything in terms of u. So that will be what? 2 u times u, u square, then u, du. Okay. Now I can do this using the integration by parts. Yeah. Hey, let, yeah, let me use the value here, sorry. Let me use the value. So that would be the value. Lin w, dw. Okay. Now I let u equal lin w. dv equal to take it out, no problem. The value square. So this one will be two integral the value square lin w dw. Two will be just a number outside. Who cares? Okay. Now I have du dw over w. V will be w cubed over three. Okay. So that will be two uv w cubed over three. Then W minus integral of what? This is W cubed of the value square. Yeah, the value square over three. DW. That will be two W cubed over three. Then W minus W cubed over nine plus C. So the answer will be what? Now return everything. I think the value is x to the power half. So that give me, I can't take over three, two over three common factor. What is remaining here? I have x to the power three over two, half to the power three, three over two, then square root of x minus, they have what? <clears throat> Same thing, x to the power 3 over 2. It's over 9, I took 3 out, that over 3. Let's see. So this is, I can take x to the power 2 over 3 common factor. I have ln square root of x minus 1 over 3. Let's see, which is this? The average value. Let's we'll say if average will be integral. No, it will be 1 over 1 minus 0 which is 1, huh? take it from 0 to 1, x tan inverse x dx. Okay. That means I can take u, x, dv tan inverse x. Oh, no, no, no. In a dw, huh? Yeah, take it to the D. I take U tan inverse X. <coughs> DV X DX. Yeah, it will work. That means DU will be what? 1 over 1 plus X square DX. V will be what? X square over 2. Okay. That will give me what? So if average will be one, halas gun, zero to one. I can do the calculation. Oh, 
uv which is x square over 2 tan inverse x minus integral 0 to 1 v du <coughs> f x square over 1 plus x square dx. Now this is from 0 to 1. If that was 0 to 1, I'm getting what? Half. Yeah, I'm getting half times by over 4. Huh? Half times by over 4. When I substitute the one, zero, zero, gone, minus half times what? Integral of this. Or do this trick. I will add half. I will add one, subtract one. I'm adding zero. So that will make it. That give me pi over eight minus half. <coughs> Take it from zero to one. If what x squared plus one, that will be one minus one over x squared plus one. Like if I am doing the long division. If we do the long division, we'll get the same answer. So that will be pi over eight. Pi over eight minus half of what x. Minus tan inverse of x from where to where from zero to one. Okay, that give me pi over eight minus half one minus pi over four. Okay, zero zero gone. Does that give me minus minus by by plus pi over four plus pi over a pi over eight plus pi over eight that will be pi over four. 2 by over 8, which is by over 4, minus half. Minus half, which is this one. Yeah. Sine inverse of x, all square, dx. Yeah. Clear, I let you. Sine inverse of x, all square. dv would be dx. See what will happen. Du will be what? 2 sine inverse of x times 1 over square root 1 minus x square. Yeah, dx. V will be x. Okay. This is 2 sine inverse of x. dx over square root. 1 minus x squared. Okay. Now, this integral will be what? Integral? No. It will be x. Oh, it's from 0 to 1. Okay. It will be x sine inverse of x. All square from 0 to 1. Minus. Minus what? Minus integral from zero to one to x sine inverse of x over square root one minus x squared dx. Mm -hmm. Now I need to think a little bit. Yeah, this is what. Two x sine inverse of x square root one minus x square. Yeah, I need by bots again. I can do it this way. Here's another color. Okay. I can. Yeah, this one substitute. You have what? One sine inverse of one, which is my over two. 
square minus zero minus or plus. I take the minus inside. I will make it this way. I will write minus two x. Yeah. I'll write the sine inverse of x times minus two x over square root one minus x squared dx. Yeah, so it's u dv now. So I have u, the sine inverse of x, dv, dv will be minus x, minus 2x to square root 1 minus x squared dx. So what is du? 1 over square root 1 minus x squared. This one is what? If this is u, this is du. Okay. So it's u to the power minus half. That give me what? V will be 2 to square root 1 minus x squared. Yeah, I can double check. Differentiate this. It will be 2, 1 over 2 square root 1 minus x squared times minus 2x. Uh, yeah, yeah. 2 cancel with 2, so I have minus 2x. Correct. So now <clears throat> this one will be y squared over 4 plus uv again to square root one minus x square sine inverse of x from zero to one which is zero minus integral this times this which is two dx from zero to one yeah that will make it i have by square over four plus when I substitute the one, it will be zero times by over two, which is zero. When I substitute the zero, it will be zero times one, which is zero. Alas. So it's zero minus two x from zero to one, which is minus two. Yeah, so this answer. Three t plus two cosine t over two. I can use uh, tabular. Since I have pronomial, it will be easy to use tabular. So I have u dv. I have u 3t plus 2, 3, 0. dv is what? Cosine t over 2. dt. No, I don't like dt. So I have what? This is integral of this. Half sine t over 2. Half or 2, 2, not half, 2. So when you, when you do the, the derivative, it will be cosine t over 2 times derivative of t over 2, which is half times 2, which is come, uh, come back to 1. Now this one will be minus 4 cosine t over 2. So my answer, I will be what? Will be this, this, this is plus, this is minus. It will be 3t plus 2 times 2 sine t over 2 minus 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 that will be plus 12 cosine t over 2 that from where to where from 0 to by okay that give me what i have substitute the by i have 3 by plus 2 times 2 sine by over 2 will be 1 times 1 plus cosine by over 2 this is 0 gun plus no need for plus minus minus what minus substitute the 0 i have 2 sine 0 0 plus no need so i have 12 cosine 0 minus 12 times 1. So I'm getting what? 6 by plus 4 minus 12, which is 6 by minus 8. Watch this one. Yeah, calculation. It's care of this. Okay. And I let 
u equal e to the power x, du will be ax dx. So I'm getting what? This one will be tan inverse of u du. Now I'll use by bots. Let make it w. Okay, it's w. Yeah, so I'll use u, u and db there. So I have u will be tan inverse of w, db equal dw. So v equal w, du, 1 over 1, plus w square. So call this i. So i will be what? Will be vw, w tan inverse of w minus integral w over 1 plus w squared dw. Here I have dw, don't forget. Now, what I have? Uh, I need to integrate this. Let me show you the color. So I take two and half outside. That will be minus. Okay. So I will be what? W, then inverse of W, minus half. This is U, this is DU. Then, 1 plus w square, which is always positive, plus c. Now I retain w. That will be, w is what? e to the power x, e to the power x, tan inverse, e to the power x, minus half, then 1, e to the power x square, which is e to x, plus c. And that will be my answer. <coughs> x to the power 5, e to the power minus x cube. Very clear, I will let u minus x cubed the u be what minus 3x squared dx so this one will be what integral x to the power 5 i will split it i need x cubed and x squared x cubed and x squared e to the power minus x cubed dx Okay, I add three here. Here's the difference coming. I add three here and one over three here. Actually, I add minus one over three and minus. So that will be my du. This with this will be du. So now let me write everything. That will be minus one over three x cubed, which is minus u, okay, equal minus x cubed, minus x cubed would be minus u, or I can, I can make this plus, and this is plus. Yeah, let take the minus inside. Okay. And I have, this will be du, so I have e to the power u du, which I know this integral, is what is e to the power u u e to the power u minus e to the power u plus c i retain everything that give me what uh, u minus one yeah uh, u is minus x cubed, so that minus x cubed, e to the power minus x cubed, minus e is minus x cubed, plus c. Take the minus outside, that minus 1 over 3, x cubed, take, yeah, and take e to the power minus x cubed as a common factor also. So I have what? Minus, that will be x cubed, plus one, and that will be my answer. For x, then x. Yeah, 
we know for x ln x, I know that the integral of x ln x dx will be what? x ln x minus x, correct? Yeah, uh, no. That will be the next. Okay. Let, let me do it. Let me do it. Okay. Now I let u equal to x. dv will be for x dx. What's good always about the integration? You can't check by substitute. You can't check by by doing that by doing the derivative. Huh? So I have du. Du will be dx over x. V will be what? 2x squared. Done. So this integral, I will be what? UV, 2x squared, 2x squared, then x, from 1 to e, from 1 to e, minus 2x dx. From one to e. Substitute, I have two e squared, lin one, lin e, which is one, lin one zero, halos. minus two, I have x squared over two, from one to e. That give me two e squared minus two times what? e squared over two minus half. That give me two e squared minus e squared plus one, which is e squared plus one. Which is this one? X cosecant square dx. Hmm. I'm very clear. I'll take this dv. Say so no, I know it's integral. Okay. I let u equal x. Du, dv, I mean, will be. We see you can square x dx. So du will be dx. And v was the integral of this minus cotan x. Okay, so the integral from pi over 4 or i, let me do i, i track. This is i. So i will be minus x cotan x from pi over 4 to pi over 2. Okay, minus integral minus cotan, which is cotan x minus cotan x dx. That will be what? Substitute cotan by over 2 is what? 0, which is cosine by over 2, which is 0 over 1, that is 0, minus by over 4. This is from pi over 4 to pi over 2. That will be minus pi over 4. Is it? Yeah. No, it's plus. Oh. It is 0 minus minus pi over 4. Minus minus pi over 4. Minus or plus. Integral of cotan. Cotan is what? Cotan is cosine over sine. So if I let this u, this is du. So you have ln of sine x from pi over 4 to pi over 2. That gives me pi over 4 plus. Plus what? Is it? Cotan is cosine over sine. Yeah. Sine by over two is one. Lin one zero. Gun. So you have one a zero minus lin of sine by over two, which is called two over two. Okay, and that is what? Or I can rewrite it. I know the square root 2 over 2 is rationalize it. 
that give me one over root two. So this is, I can rewrite it, by over four minus then one over root two, which is by over four minus, this is ln one minus ln square root of two. And that by over four, ln one is zero minus minus, that will be plus ln square root of two, which is this answer. A to the power x cosine to x. Yeah, this is, I make it i and then, yeah, I do the calculation. Okay, u equal cosine to x, the x, um, cosine the x, dv will be e to x dx. You know what? Let me do it without the, the definite integral, and then I will I'll do the substitution at the end instead of making complication here. Du, because it's a little bit complicated. Du will be what? Minus 2 sine 2x dx. B will be half e to x. Okay, so I without the definite integral, I just as an indefinite integral, then I will do the substitution at the end. It will be half e to x cosine to x minus this times this minus e to x sine to x dx. Now we need to do this again, or let me rewrite it, half e to x cosine to x plus e to x sine to x dx. I'll do by parts again for this one. So I have u equal sine to x dv e to x dx. So v will be half e to x du will be minus 2 cosine plus 2 y minus plus 2 cosine to x. So this one will be half e to x cosine to x plus plus what? This times this half e to x sine to x. Okay, minus integral of what? A to x cosine to x dx. This is my i. And this is i. So I take this to the other side. So I have 2i will be half a to x, I can this common factor, cosine to x, plus sine to x. So i, 1 over 4, a to x, times cosine to x, plus sine to x. So now the integral, from pi over 2 to pi of this this one I divide I, I, I just substitute that will be 1 over 4 with pi e to the power 2 pi times what cosine 2 pi which is 1 sine 2 by 0 times times 1 minus now with pi over 2 1 over 4 I take it as a common factor out because it will not be affected this is e i to the power 2 times pi over 2 which is e to the power pi times what cosine pi which is minus 1 plus 0 that give me what 1 over 4 times e to by minus times minus plus e to the power by. And that is my answer. This one is easier. 
Yeah, we did it, I think, before. Yeah, excellent x. This is four, this is two. So I just divide by two. So e squared plus one over two. Yeah, you can do it. No need to waste time. E to the power square root t plus one. Hmm. What shall I do? I take u. I take u. Let's go to t plus one. I'll see what will happen. The u will be what? One over two root t plus one dx. Or if you look at it, dt dt. I'm taking in terms of t dt. So dt will be two dt will be two root t plus one du. What is root two of t? What is root two of t plus one? Is the u when I du du. Now let me write everything in terms of this. So the integral, I put minus one, minus one plus one, that's from zero. Three plus one, square root of four, which is two. And dt is two u du. So the equation becomes two, zero to two, u e u du. By parts, or I know this integral, u e u minus e u from zero to two. That will be two, two e square minus e square. Yeah. Is it e u minus e u? Yeah, this is e u. And I'm getting u e u. Yeah. This is two, two e square minus e square minus zero minus one. That will be two e square plus one. That will be two e square plus two, which is this one. Secant x tan x e to the power sine x dx plus integral this. Why I need this? this? Yeah, this is the trick. Very clear here. I will have this is as dv, and this is will be my u. Let me see what will happen. I put u. E sine x. Okay. This is my u. And dv secant x tan x. Which I know it. Dx. Which I know how, how to integrate this. V will be what? Secant x. Du will be e sine x times cosine x times cosine x dx. So this integral, this integral only, 0 to pi over 6 of secant. Let me do it at, at, at once. Tan x, all of it. Huh? Something will be cancelled. Very clear now for me. Something will be cancelled. Plus zero to pi over six, e to the power sine x dx. This one using uv, I have what secant x, e sine x. That from zero to pi over six minus integral for zero to pi over six, v du secant times cosine one. So I have e sine x dx and that plus the same thing and that the trick so this is the same of this so this is cancelled now i can substitute secant by over six is what that is two hmm? secant 
30. Hmm? This is Bible 6, yeah. Keeping it Bible 6. Second 30 is screw root of 2. Or 2. Minus e to the power zero one minus one. Second thirty is what? Two over root three. Yeah, cosine thirty is root three, root three over two. So second will be two over root three. E to the power sign this which is half minus secant zero is one sign zero is zero e to the power zero so that is minus one or i can rewrite this two e over three under the square root minus one which is this one yeah Integral x, 2 to the power x dx. So I let u to be x dv 2 to the power x dx. But you need to be careful to do the integration. v will be what? It will be 2 to the power x over lin 2. Okay. And du will be dx. Okay. So the integral 0 to 1 x 2 to the power x dx will be what? uv x 2 to the power x over lin 2 from 0 to 1 minus integral of 0 to 1. 2 to the power x over lin 2 dx. Lin 2 is just a number, so I can take it out. That's it. Substitute now. Let me do a substitution. I have 1, 2 to the power 1. That is 2 over lin 2. 0, plus minus 0. Gun, minus. This one is the integral. Lin 2, 1 over lin 2, I can take it out. What's the integral of 2 to the power x? Again, 2 to the power x over lin 2, from 0 to 1. So that'll give me what? 2 over lin 2 minus 2 to the power x over lin 2 square, from 0 to 1. This is from 0 to 1. So you have 2 over lin 2 minus what? 2 over lin 2 square, Minus substitute the zero minus one over the two square. Hmm. Yeah, so this will give me what two over the two. Here I have two over the two square minus one over the two square that give me minus one over the two square. So now I can take lin2 all square as a common denominator. I have 2 lin2 minus 1, which is this one. Okay. Secant is square x lin time x. Yeah, maybe this is not. Uh, yeah. Very clear, I'll let this u. This will be my du. So let u will be tan x, du will be secant square x dx. So i will be integral ln u du. Now we'll use the by parts. So yeah. So I have u is w, dv is dw, v equal w, 
du will be dw over w. So i will be integral, not integral class, uv, which is w in w, minus integral w times d, 1 over w, that is dw. That will be w in w minus w plus c. I retain w, which is tan x. That will be tan x. Then tan x minus tan x plus c, which is this one. 3x to the power minus half lin x. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, not difficult. U minus lin x, dv, 3x to the power minus half dx. I can integrate this. Yeah. du will be dx over x. That will make it easier now. V will be what? 3, I add 1 times 2, x to the power half. Now, just another calculation. This is i. So i will be u 6x to the power half ln x from 1 to e square minus integral of 6 x to the power half times x, that x to the power minus half. Oh, x to the power half over x, x is my oh, x to the power minus half dx. So now substitute, I have 6e ln e square, which is 2. This is from 1 to e. Okay. Okay, minus ln 1, 0, halas, gun. I have 12e, you know, minus. This one is what? What is this integral? It will be 6, 2x to the power half from 1 to e. That give me what? 12e minus. Substitute this. It will be 12. This is e squared, sorry. 12e. 12e minus. Substitute minus 12. 1 to the power half is 1. So that will be 12e minus 12e plus 12. And the answer is 12, which is this one. This is cancelled. X squared cosine hyperbolic. Oh. Same thing. I let you X squared dv cosine hyperbolic x dx. So it will be v sine hyperbolic x. It will be du 2x dx. I think I need the tabular. The tabular will be better. Yeah, since it's x squared, and I need to reach the, the one. I need to do it two times. So I have x squared cosine hyperbolic x. Cosine hyperbolic x. So this is 2x, 2, 0. This is sine hyperbolic x, cosine hyperbolic x, sine hyperbolic x. This, this, this. This is plus, minus, plus. This is i. So i will be what? x squared sine hyperbolic x minus 2x cosine hyperbolic x plus 2 sine hyperbolic x plus c. So I can write it x squared plus 2 sine hyperbolic x minus 2x cosine sine hyperbolic x plus c. What is this one? Or x tan square x dx. Mm. Yeah. I will let you yeah. two tan secret. It will be two tan secret squares. That will make it complicated. I can use this trick. This I will make it from 0 to pi over 4. 4 x. I can deal with secant easier. But I can do it right away. Yeah. 
I can say this is one plus tan square equals secant square, so that is, will be secant square minus one dx. So I have four x secant square x dx minus four x dx. This is how we leave it. This is easy to do. Just I will work in this one. Okay. So let me call this i. This is my i. This integral my i. Now we'll do u v. I have u for x. Take the four out. Don't be bothered with the four. That will be x. Dv is secant square x dx. This I know how to integrate. V will be tan x. Okay. And this is dx. Yeah, now, now, now it's clear. I, let me call this I1, and this is I. I1 will be what? X tan x from 0 to pi over 4 minus integral from 0 to pi over 4 of tan x dx. And that give me what? Pi over 4, tan pi over 4 is 1, tan 0 is 0, so pi over 4 minus. What is the integral of tan? Tan is sine over cosine. Tan, if you think about it, is sine over cosine. So if this is u, I need minus there. So I took the minus, so I need minus tan x. This is minus. So this is will be lin, lin cosine. Lin cosine x from 0 to pi over 4. And that give me what? Pi over 4. Don't forget there is 4 outside, huh? I forget the 4. This is 4x. So this is 4 times everything, huh? 4 times all of this. So this is 4 times all of this. So I have 4 times all of this. Pi over 4. This is lin. What is cosine pi over 2? Cosine pi over 4 is uh, 1 over root 2. It will be 1. Lin. Lin 1 over root 2. Lin 1 over root 2. is not minus. It's minus. This will be minus then 1 over root 2. Yeah. 1 over root 2. Okay. Minus cosine 0 is 1, minus then 1, 0, plus gun. So this is will be what? By minus 4. This what in 1? Then 1. Let me do it in, in, in detail. The root of two. That will be by minus four, zero. This is I can two to the power half, so it's half lin two. So that will be by minus two lin two. That only I want. That only this. I'm doing it in details. This one. Let me call it I2. I2 will be what? Yeah, where to write it? Let me write it here. I2 will be 2x square from 0 to pi over 4. And that will be what? 2 by square over 16 minus 0, which is by square over 8. I is I1 minus I2. And that is by by minus 2 into minus I2, which is by square over 8, which is this one. Yeah, calculation, but then you'll be careful about it. 8x, then x. What is this? 2, then 4, then... The same question, 2x, then x, 
So I need to multiply by four. That will be two e squared plus two. Two times e squared plus one. For x cosine square, we did something so. For x cosine square, x cosecant square. No. Or x cosine squared. Yeah. You know what the trick I will do? I will change it into double angle. And then, then I can use the, the tabler or, or I can use my parts easily. Yeah. So I know that cosine square. I know that cosine square is half plus half cosine to x. So this integral, call it i. So i will be for integral for x half plus half cosine to x dx. And that is what? Integral of 2x dx plus integral of 2x cosine dx dx. Yeah. So this is, they call it, this is i1 and this is i2. i1 is nothing, just x squared. So I don't care about i1. i1 is very clear. This is i1 is x squared. Let me work out i2. For i2, what will happen? I need the pi parts. So I let u equal x2. I can take it outside. dv. Or I can use tabler. Huh? Tabler, I think, will do it easier. So I have x cosine to x. I can put 2. Who cares? That will be 2. That will be 0. So I have here half sine to x and then i have minus one over four cosine to x then i need this and i need this this is plus this is minus so i2 i2 will be what sine to x sine to x minus plus half cosine to x plus c this is plus c, okay, so, so i will be i1 plus i2, and that will be, I don't need plus c, plus c, one of them is enough, plus x sine to x plus half cosine to x plus c, and that will be my answer. I think what I did is, is 